Hey guys and welcome to my channel BitGlen. My name's Glenn and I like to share with you what I learn in the world of cryptocurrency as I go through it. Today's topic we're going to learn about how you can earn yourself some free DAI up to $20 worth. But before we get into that, smash that like button. It really helps with the channel grow. So don't forget to hit that like before you leave. We're also at 1,469 subscribers. So I only need 31 more subscribers and we're at the 1500 mark, which is awesome. So thank you very much for all the support that you guys give. Now let's get into the main topic of the video. So I got an email from Coinbase. Let's just go over to it. How does Coinbase earn work? So you watch educational videos, you complete a quiz, you earn diet in your Coinbase account for every quiz you complete. Start today. Earn opportunities and only available for a limited time for a small set of customers. Now, you may be thinking, well, hang on a minute, Glenn. How did you get on this list of customers? So I noticed when I checked my Coinbase account pretty much for the first time in months um, the other day that there was this earn scheme going on. Uh, you'll probably see it if you view it from a, um, a computer. It will say like uh, Coinbase Earn. You click on it and then there's a little button somewhere that says um, register your interest or register for earn or something like that, which I did the other day. I got an email today saying be one of the first to earn from day. So I thought I would video the experience with you guys and we're going to see how true to their word that Coinbase are. So I've had a few issues with Coinbase recently, so I'm not too impressed with them. But let's give it a try. It's free money. Why not? So let, let's get started. I've clicked the link that's got sent to me and we have a few lessons here. Now these lessons are videos which actually I went through and watched all these the other day and I didn't earn anything from it. I just watched them because I wanted to know about die. So I've already seen a lot of these anyway, but it seems here you earn $2 uh, for every video that you watch. They take about a minute and a half, two minutes. Um, and then this is what I couldn't do because it was grayed out to me. I couldn't actually earn it uh, by doing the quiz, I believe. So let's um, go through and start earning some. DAI is a cryptocurrency that aims to be worth exactly one US dollar. It's called a stable coin because it aims to have a stable value. Other cryptocurrencies are constantly going up or down against the US dollar, not DAI. DAI attempts to be worth as close to one dollar as possible. Because it's a stable coin, people who hold DAI worry less about the price falling which would cause their holdings to lose value. They also worry less about DAI's price going up, making them regret a big purchase in the past. In 2010, oh, yeah. someone famously bought two pizzas for 10,000 Bitcoin, worth about $30 at the time. <clears throat> that amounts to several million dollars per pizza today. It's a famous if pizza. If only they could have used 30 DAI to buy those pizzas instead. Besides being a stable coin, DAI is also a decentralized cryptocurrency running on the Ethereum blockchain. Being a cryptocurrency gives it advantages over cash, such as efficient global transfers, programmable transactions, and more. In the next lesson, we'll explore how these advantages make DAI a useful store of value and means of exchange. So that was it. That was a nice straightforward uh, two minutes. So let's take the quiz based on that information we've learned. Uh, what is DAI? A cryptocurrency focused on privacy, a decentralized gaming uh, protocol, a decentralized stablecoin that aims to be worth one US dollar, an open source project built on top of the Bitcoin, a centralized stablecoin. So we know the answer is this one. Nice work. You're on your way to understanding DAI. <laughs> that's it. One question. That's not a quiz. That's a question. <laughs> right. So anyway, I've watched these. I don't know if I have to what? sit and watch them all again. Let's take the quiz. Uh, what are the two features of DAI? Backed by banks with a limited supply, based in Canada and used to interbank transfers, closed source and updated monthly, private and centralized, decentralized and borderless. Did I get that right? Pow! How does DAI... Oh, now the question on this may be tough. So let's, uh, let's re-watch this video. It's actually quite how complicated does DAI stay how DAI stays stable. stable. DAI is a stable coin that this aims is to be worth one US version. dollar. How is that possible? Let's take a look. This is Margaret. She has Ethereum or ETH and she wants some DAI. To get DAI, she could buy some with her ETH on an exchange. Or if she doesn't want to sell her ETH, she could use it to generate DAI. It works something like this. Let's say Margaret wants 100 DAI. In order to generate it, Margaret can deposit her Ethereum into something called a CDP. 
Think of a CDP as a vault for Margaret's collateral. The exact amount of dye she generates is proportional to the amount of ETH she deposits. A typical ratio is three to one. That means if she deposits $300 worth of ETH, she gets $100 of dye back. As soon as she deposits that ETH, she gets dye. Now she can use that dye however she wants. In order to get her Ethereum back, she has to return the dye and pay what's called a stability fee. The simple system creates economic incentives that aim to keep dye equal to $1. Here's how the incentives work. If dye falls below $1, Margaret can buy some cheap dye and use that to get her Ethereum back at a discount. If dye goes above $1, Margaret can do the opposite. She can generate dye against her ETH and gain additional purchasing power. When you have thousands of Margarets generating and paying back dye, these economic incentives, along with publicly voted on adjustments to the stability fee, aim to keep the price of dye at one US dollar. This system isn't magic. It's math, economics, and open source code. Today, the dye creation process is one of the largest decentralized applications in the world, with over $300 million of ETH held in CDPs. I checked the price of Maker coin reason, earlier, and since it, it was is, launched in 2017, dye has like stayed close in value to one US dollar. That's a big accomplishment in the ever evolving world of decentralized finance. All right, let's take the quiz. How do you generate die by open a CDP with maker? Ba ding, I've earned two die. We're getting there guys, we're getting here. We've earned six die so far. Woo! Wow, that seems the end of the road there. So uh, we've earned that. Now we want to earn the 14 die. In this lesson, you'll learn how to generate die by using Coinbase Wallet to open a centralized a col collateralized debt position CDP with Maker. Complete the tutorial and you'll earn 14 die. Oh, it's not let me do it. It's let me watch the first few videos and now I can't do the final one. What a rip off. <laughs> it was free, but it's still a rip off. Let's have a little look. Well, the die hasn't gone into my wallet yet. Oh, hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Okay, fair enough. So I've actually received the $6 worth of die, which obviously in British pounds isn't that much. But I wonder why I can't earn the extra 14. But maybe it times you out. Maybe you can only earn so much. Um, let's see if we can go back to... And crypto, continue, 14 die remaining. Well, yeah, I want to earn the 14 die. Six uh, dollars for six minutes of my time. That's not too bad. So obviously the I see now that the path there they're actually going down is to educate people about die. Maybe people that are not into cryptocurrency at all. You gotta remember Coinbase are trying to make it very easy to uh, be an on and off ramp to Bitcoin. So they were one of the largest and still are one of the largest off ramps around the world to sort of buy into Bitcoin. But now obviously they're offering these lessons so that you feel comfortable with trying to deposit die, maybe buy die, maybe set up a CDP. And obviously Coinbase are taking a cut in there somewhere. So actually, yeah, it's quite clever because they're almost incentivizing people to learn about it so that hopefully they then go on and say oh yeah i can make money by buying dying and selling it at the right time so yeah it's very clever so that's it guys that was it you may think oh that was a bit of a boring video i'm sorry uh if you are interested in joining up to coinbase to take a part in this earn cryptocurrency uh, i'm actually going to copy this link and I'm going to put it in the description down below. So if you join Coinbase, uh, you can see here I get £8.28. And I think you receive £8.28 as well, as long as you uh, buy and deposit £82 worth of cryptocurrency. So you don't have to use it, but that's a referral link. I'll put it in the description below or it's an invite a friend link. Um, feel free to click on that link. Help support me if you want, if you decide to join up with Coinbase. So that's it. We've... Um, covered the die if i was just discussing in that video that the maker token they're the company that actually run and obviously organize the cdps 
Um, I was having a look earlier and Maker, they're 22nd in the top 100 cryptocurrencies and their coin is worth $442. And this was actually one of the few coins that was actually up against Bitcoin and it hasn't actually gone down as much as Bitcoin has done recently. Obviously, Bitcoin's had a massive drop off. The uh, Maker coin has uh, held its own. So that's really good news. Let's uh, put the USD price up here. You can see here they haven't had the massive slump off of uh, its value. And at one point it was worth over a thousand dollars and not just once, twice. Uh, three times actually. It's been worth more than a thousand dollars. Currently sitting at uh, $437. So who knows, that might be a good buy for the future if you're thinking of investing in other coins. And then obviously you have the DAI itself, which is a stable coin. So if you have 10 of them, they will always be worth $1 or very close to $1. So uh, if you don't want to wager the risks of losing your money. But the good thing is obviously you back it with your Ethereum. So you can actually get your Ethereum back out. But I believe they charge you a fee and I'm not 100% sure what that fee is. Um, so it might be worth looking into uh, before you start investing into uh, creating DAI as a stable coin, which would have been good to do this week, I suppose, uh, with the price of Bitcoin dropping so rapidly. So that's it from me, guys. And as you saw, actually, from there, I did actually buy some Bitcoin uh, eventually. My Coinbase got set up and uh, I, I bought £500 worth of Bitcoin while it's at these prices. Um, I'm actually still looking to use the ATM because I'm going to compare their fees. I've made a note of the fees of how much it is to buy it through uh, this Coinbase transaction. And I, I, I actually was interested. I thought, I can't remember what the fees were last time I used the Bitcoin ATM. I'm actually in London over the weekend and I'm going to see how many Bitcoin ATMs there are while I'm there. And obviously try and find one and try and put some cash into it and get it sent to my Exodus account. So... Uh, that would be awesome. Let's, um, so yeah, there you go. There's my uh, balance that I bought um, of Bitcoin. I actually bought it when the prices were just under $8,100, um, just to make a, a little timestamp of that. Um, so, bought some with Coinbase, but what I wanted to tell you guys was that they've changed their bank account. So they must have had a falling out or something with Barclays I think they were with which is one of the largest banks in the UK they seem to be with a bank now called clear bank and when you actually go for and request to do a bank transfer this is how I bought my 500 pounds worth in the end uh, for some reason they wouldn't let me do it with my card do the usual sort code count number and use a reference code in the reference I did that the money went over I got an email within five minutes to say we've received your money the money was straight there I then used Coinbase Pro to, uh, oh no, sorry, I actually used Coinbase to buy the Bitcoin with my GBP wallet um, and then sent that balance over to Exodus. And I must say, when I click send through Coinbase, uh, the little chingy noise, you know, the ching sound uh, that Exodus makes, it was like, as I clicked it, it chinged. So it split second, split second uh, for 500 um pounds worth of bitcoin to go over so i thought that was really good actually so uh, i'm not bigging coinbase up they have let me down a, a few times recently but maybe they're making up for it i don't know but interesting to see where they go from here and uh, obviously they're adding more and more coins onto here uh, as you can see the only ones really i'd be interested in at the moment are bitcoin ethereum maybe litecoin um and that's it uh obviously now i have five five to six pounds worth of uh, dye. Whoop, whoop. So if you're watching this video and you want to earn some free cryptocurrency, uh, do the learn course and hopefully later on today, it's a shame I couldn't do it with you guys. I really wanted to do it while you guys were watching. Let's just try it one more time before it says $14 remaining. So it's saying I can earn it. This task is temporary unavailable. Come back later. Damn it. Um, maybe that's for another video. We'll do the advanced course. So that's it from me guys Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and also if you're new to this channel Don't forget to click the subscribe button 
I'll see you guys over the weekend at some point. And don't forget, we do the Team BitGlen live podcast every Sunday night around about 9 p.m. UK time. Um, and you can join the Telegram group chat, which is listed down below. There's no shilling, no scams, um, no referral links offered in there. Um, and also we have the Discord live chat where you can actually voice chat uh, to actually get involved with the conversation on the podcast. So that's it from me. I'll see you later, guys. Bye.